Well, it sure used to be if you wanted to watch TV, you'd head to the living room anymore. Rich DeMuro explains how your tablet can access live TV on the go. Waiting in line for a plane or taking the train, these days you can be anywhere and still enjoy your favorite shows. Now live TV is making its way to your mobile devices. You might even be able to access it for free. Television, America's favorite pastime. Or was it baseball? Well, either way, we love our shows, dramas, comedies, sports, and more. The DVR set us free from the network schedule. Now streaming technology and high-speed internet connections are letting us watch from just about anywhere. A new feature from our friends at AT&T U-verse lets you watch over 100 channels live on tablets and smartphones. For so many years, you had to watch TV in your living room. This is TV on your terms. The channels you get depend on your subscription, but we're talking big names in entertainment like Bravo, Comedy Central, and E. So basically, you can turn any tablet or smartphone into a television and take it anywhere you want to go. Sometimes it's nice to watch shows at home on your DVR, but when you're watching sporting events, you want to see those live. Think about the possibilities. Keep up with your favorite stars while you're walking the stars. I get to enjoy music while they learn how to play it. Now you can watch TV where they make TV. Just download the UVerse app and you're good to go. UVerse is always bringing the freshest technology to our customers and we're always the first in innovation. And this is just another example of that. This is a classic. Am I right? Just keep an eye on your data plan. Those episodes can add up real fast. If you want to learn more, you can go to our website. It's thetechreport.tv. I'm Rich DeMuro. All right, here is another live picture from Cape Canaveral where they were scheduled to have a launch of a rocket just minutes ago. And as you can see in the upper right-hand corner, they stopped the countdown at two seconds. This is the Falcon 9 SpaceX rocket launch. Apparently, crews there at Cape Canaveral say that they experienced a shutdown after ignition. Uh, the vehicles, the engines went into a safe mode. Apparently, they were not all firing at the same time, and the computer then moved in to shut, the, shut it down. Now they're looking at the data before deciding their next step. This rocket is carrying a satellite into space, uh, carrying a geostationary spatel, uh, satellite. It was supposed to take off on Monday, but some problems then forced a delay, and it was recommended by the folks at Cape Canaveral that they launch today. But it looks as if they're in a holding pattern right now. If that should change in the next few minutes or so, we'll be back with you and let you know what's going on. Well, from some of the newest technology to the not-so-new, the blast from the past that stumped some children. And no stumping where is a good place to go tonight. Uh, looks like a lot of fun out there at Steinberg. Plenty cold to keep that ice frozen as well. I'll tell you how cold it's going to get tonight. And if we have a warm-up on the way for the weekend, it's all coming your way after the break. This portion of the news is brought to you by AT&T U-verse. Would you look at this? That's the U-verse. She's recording four shows at the same time. In our day, if mom was recording shows, there was no DVR to save your bacon. Exactly. Miss an episode of Scooby-Doo? Suddenly he's got a cousin. Where did he come from? You have no idea. The narrative is completely thrown off. The show just doesn't make sense. No, it does not. Get UVerse TV for $19 a month for two years with qualifying bundles. Rethink possible. Take advantage of hundreds.